Well, hey guys, I hope this time I can actually sync my stuff better. And I actually switched my SD card out. Maybe that'll make a difference. It's just, before it was a class two, I put a class, I think it's a class four, not a class six. I do have both class fours and a class six SD card. And then there's a class 10 in my DSLR camera. But um, maybe that'll make a difference in actually recording the sound better and lasting. I don't know, maybe it has something to do with uh, when I change the video into an MP3 video, uh, song, well, audio. Anywho, it's been getting colder and I've been layering up this year instead of, I was planning on actually buying another come on dude if you're gonna go go you gonna go are you gonna go go there you go I was planning on buying another tour master heated vest because it just rocked last year however it did break and I had to return it to motorcycle superstore but I got my money back. A full refund for it, thank God. I guess, oh shoot. Sorry, there's some traffic guys. I really don't want to get run into. And So I got a full refund, all my 120 bucks back, because it was under warranty for three years, and uh, I don't think I'll buy the vest. If I buy it again, I won't buy it from Motorcycle Superstore, because they actually gave me a lot of crap over returning it and getting my money back. It took me about two months before I even saw my return money, which makes sense. But they wanted me to test it out and make sure it was the actual vest itself and not like the, the harness for the battery pack or anything. Anywho, I've decided against not even buying the whole thing because that's, it turned out that's what killed my stator and my rectifier. Apparently, the super sport bikes aren't meant to be ridden on the road. <laughs> Think of that, right? It's meant to be on the track and when they're on the track, they don't even have a headlight. So. They use all their power for their performance. So if, as you keep adding things to your battery, it just hurts the, the electrical system on your bike. Now, if I had a, uh, a touring bike, sure, I would put so many things on that thing. Sadly, I don't. So this year, I'm gonna have to just bear it and, you know, layer up but returning to the ninja video that I posted like a week ago well, it was actually a couple days but I'm sure by the time you guys see this it'll be a, about a week I don't know which way I want to go but why is there so much traffic there's not there shouldn't be that much traffic here I guess I'll just go in here because everyone else is. I don't like cutting people off, but if I don't see a reason for why people are slowing down, it's kind of dumb to just wait in that line. So yeah, I'll be layering up. I can't even use little hotties anymore because the gloves I bought they can't even fit liners in them and I use usually use my liners that have little pockets on them and I put my little hotties in there uh, this time I can't do that at all so my hands will be the coldest part on me I am also now an icon tester so uh, probably just for the season I don't know maybe they'll ask me to come back 
but they let me try out some gear and I have on the, well they said it wasn't patrol pants, but I, they look very similar to patrol pants and they don't have all the features of the patrol pants. So I think they're like the testing fit version. Anyways, they just had them lying around and they handed them to me. And I'll be reviewing those for you guys. I'm actually wearing them right now. Um, I've been wearing them for about a month straight. It's been pretty cold out here. The coldest it's gotten this winter season has been about 28 degrees. Uh, this morning it was 30. Pretty dang cold. So, just cruising around Portland like I do. I will have an update on my current raffle game. I decided against doing a contest and decided to go with a raffle game. A lot of people have been interested in actually just giving me money for track days and whatnot, and so I decided to got, uh, give you guys back something. And I'll talk about more about it later with a dedicated raffle video. <laughs> But yeah, today is November 10th, 2011, and tomorrow will be 11 11 11. So, exciting about that. But you guys have. Oh, yeah, I forgot! So, I said I was gonna review some icon pants, and I also have an icon helmet that they gave me, so I'll review that one too. And those are what you guys can see. Maybe I'll have something later for you. Oh my god, I don't even know if I put this in the video or not, so I'll have to probably edit it back in, but... I got Nacho... When, it, when Nacho broke, it was on a Monday, and it took about a week to get the stator in to our local dealership. And right after that is when we put it into our, my bike, so... Um, Nacho has been up and running since that day, so it only took a week off vacation. And I was only riding the Ninja for a week. So you guys don't have to worry about that. You guys always... I could tell that you guys were sad that Nacho wasn't around. But he's back up and running. Wow, oh, there's a lot of motorcycles out. And he's pretty good. Why does this guy have his brakes on constantly? Really, dude? Really? Get out of the fast lane if you can't go fast. <laughs> 